the widely popular stun series, Emerald series, and Guinea World Legend have all returned. I know you are thinking of every method to get it cheaper. Very Why chill. be afraid while Kazuki is here? I will do my utmost to accommodate those lovely skins into your budget. Hi guys, Kazuki here, and in this video, we will talk about how to get the stun series, Emerald series, or Guinea World Legend cheaper. Let's start with a brief introduction of the event. As always, the daily initial row will cost 100 diamonds and will be decreased by 50% each day, costing only 50 diamonds for the first row. The 10 rows cost 1000 diamonds and are discounted by 50% for a one time only, costing just 500 diamonds. It also ensures a special or better for the first 10 rows, after which it changes to elite or better skin. Let me inform you about the draw prizes. The draw rewards are mentioned for the 15th, 20th, 30th, 40th and 15th draws. 15 Dragon Crest in the 15th, 20th and 30th draws. Also the 40th and 50th draws grant 30 Dragon Crest each. The old star promo diamonds can also be utilized during the event. You can only utilize 80 promo diamonds per 1x draw and cannot use it for 10x draws. A checkbox will allow you to choose whether or not to use promo diamonds. This time, the skin tag will have a new feature that is rather unusual. There will be two separate tags, gold tag and silver tag. Each will have a unique ID number, which will most likely correspond to the number of people that possess the skin. The gold tag will be accessible for the first week only, after you receive Moscow skin. Following that, one will get the silver tag. Let's head to the exchange shop now. The main skins appears to be rather large currently and can be exchanged for 800 Dragon Crest. Guinea World Sign of Tomorrow can be traded for 1600 Crest. The Stun series and the M World series can be traded for 600 Crest. Then we have Bible Epic skins and Lightburn skins that can be traded for 400 crest. Special skins can be traded for 300 dragon crest. Finally, we have familiarity sweets that can be exchanged for 4 dragon crest up to 100 times. All the listed skins can be gifted too, just that you will need to own the skin before you can gift it. Let's look at the rules now. The first rule is that we can receive the skin tag by drawing for it, trading it or receiving it as a gift from a friend. The second rule states that all star promo diamonds can also be utilized during the event. Each draw adds 5 to 15 points to the wish score, with a slight chance of adding 1000 points straight. The high tier skins will be converted into 200 dragon crest each. For duplicate legend skin, players will receive 400 dragon crest. Duplicates of epic skins will yield 80 dragon crest. Each duplicate special skin will be converted into 50 dragon crest. For every elite skin duplicate, players will get 20 dragon crest. Duplicates of basic skin will result in 10 dragon crest each. Duplicate battle emotes will be transformed into 3 dragon crest. The drop rates stand as follows. All star exclusive, legend, collector or exclusive epic skins will have a 0.03% drop rate. Epic skins have a 0.11% drop rate. Special skins have a 1.36% drop rate. Elite skins have a 9.04% drop rate. Basic skins have a 9.05% drop rate. Dragon Crest has a 20.82% drop rate. Moving to wish score. Common wish box or 200 wish scores provides a 50% chance of receiving either basic or elite skins. The rare wish box or 300 wish scores contains special or elite skins. Epic wish box or 400 wish scores include special skins and epic skins. Legendary wish box or 500 wish scores contains epic skins and high tier skins such as collector and all star exclusive skins. 
Mythic Wish Box or 1000 Wish Scores grant an ultra rare skin including time limited epic, collector and all star exclusive skins. With the event introduction complete, let's look at how we can get Dragon Crest. The first will be via daily recharge rebate. Recharging 100 diamonds for 3 days will provide you with 3 Dragon Mark tokens. If you continue for 8 days, you will receive 2 more tokens as well as the emote. Secondly, you can accumulate 2 additional tokens by signing in on specific dates. Following that, we have the Mega Draw event. You can get up to 14 Dragon Mark tokens from here at lower cost along with the chance to win up to 50,000 diamonds. Pre-registering a chest will also provide you with one Dragon Mark token. Then we have Recharge Task. In Phase 1, logging into the game gets one Dragon Mark token. Recharging any quantity of diamonds will provide one Dragon Mark token. One Dragon Mark token and 50 promo diamonds to recharge 50 diamonds. 2 Dragon Mark tokens and 70 Promo Diamonds to recharge 100 diamonds. 4 Dragon Mark tokens and 80 Promo Diamonds to recharge 250 diamonds. 4 Dragon Mark tokens and 100 Promo Diamonds to recharge 500 diamonds. Spending 100 diamonds will provide 1 Dragon Mark token. Spending 250 diamonds will provide 2 Dragon Mark tokens. And spending 500 diamonds will provide 2 Dragon Mark tokens. Completing 2 matches or playing a match with the buddy will unlock this chest which contain elite skin. This task may be eliminated. Finally, 500 Pro Diamonds for recharging 1000 Diamonds. A phase 1 will provide us with 18 Dragon Mark Tokens and 800 Promo Diamonds. Task in Phase 2 will be similar to those in Phase 1, except for Promo Diamonds and recharging 1000 Diamonds. In total, 18 tokens will be granted. So we can get a total of 36 free draws from the recharge phase and 22 more free tokens from various other sources, giving us a whooping 58 free tokens if we collect them all. However, I know collecting them all will be impossible. Now that you know how to get your promo diamonds and free tokens to maximize the draws in the event, let's start calculating how to get the skins at a cheaper price. If you are aiming for the stern skin series or emerald skin series, Here's what you have to do. We need 600 crests to get ourselves stern and emerald skins. So with an average draw per crest at 10, we will need around 60 draws to make enough crest. Firstly, collect all the promo diamonds from the old star festival, which will give you a total of 825 promo diamonds at zero cost. Then you have to complete all the recharge tasks from recharge phase 1 except the recharge 1000 diamond task. Now we have a total of 1125 promo diamonds and 13 free draws in the event without spending anything. Use the 13 free draws in the event and for the spend task, use the diamond recharge with promo diamonds to do 14 draws and complete all the spend tasks until 250 diamonds to get those 3 extra draws from the spend task. The total diamonds spent till now are 280 diamonds and 1120 promo diamonds. Use the extra draws to bring your draw counter to 30 draws. As we had recharged 500 plus diamonds for the recharge task in phase 1, we will have minimum of 220 diamonds left in our store. Bring them to good use and go for 4 1x draws daily and bring our draw counter to 34 draws. The total diamond spent will be 480 diamonds. Now be patient and wait for the phase 2 recharge task. When it goes live, recharge 500 plus diamonds to get all the free tokens from the recharge task. 13 draws to be exact. Use them to draw in the event and make our draw counter at 47 draws. Now for the spending task, use one daily discount draw and two normal draws for completing the 250 spend task and get three more extra draws. And you will be at 53 draws after spending 730 diamonds. Remember, the event can also grant us extra crest. This is a calculated gamble and has some loopholes, like missing four tickets from spending 500 diamond tasks. If we also take that into the equation, then in phase 1, our total spending will be 545 diamonds with a draw count of 35 draws. And in phase 2, our total spending will be 500 diamonds 
and will leave us at a draw count of 59 draws, giving guaranteed stun or M wealth skins. We can use the daily discount draws to fill in the remaining. So if we complete the 500 diamond task too, the cost will be 1045 diamonds without using daily discounts. Remember, the missing draws can always be filled with tokens from various other extra events and can help you close in the draw counter easier with less expenditure. And as you are having a minimum of 50 draws, you can easily collect 105 crests from the draw rewards, reducing your price even further, maybe up to 500 diamonds only, depending on your draw plates. What do you think? Will you take this gamble? Share your thoughts in the comment section. Now that you have the idea of how to get cheaper stun skins, let's see how much diamonds we will need to get Giniverse Sign of Tomorrow skin. Giniverse Legend skins can be exchanged at 1600 Chris, which is quite a number. But to get there in the cheapest way possible, here's what you will need to do. Try to complete all the free token tasks I mentioned earlier giving you a total of 58 draws and spending 2,197 diamonds. 58 draws will give you around 600 crest. And we know we can get 105 crest from completing 50 draws. So the total crest we get is somewhere above 700 crest. We still will need 900 crest, which you know is a huge number. The event will last for 25 days so if we can do 23 1x daily discounted draws, increasing the crest counter to around 950 crest and the close to 3447 diamonds. We have to get the remaining crest using 10x draws, so the average price you will need around 3.5k to 5k diamonds to get this skin. Remember, the price of the skin will drop according to the number of crest you will obtain. You can be as lucky as getting 600 plus crests from just 30 draws or be unlucky to do 55 plus draws for 600 crests, which creates a huge gap in the price. I think this gamble will be completely worth it. So are you clear about how to get your dream skins at a cheaper price? Which skin are you looking at from the price pool? Share your thoughts in the comment section down below. That will be all for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Keep supporting Kazuki Official.